Now I'm gonna be honest, as much as I love packing my bags and traveling for photography, there's one thing I hate. It's having to charge all my batteries before I go and also wherever I stay. And I really hate having to bring individual chargers. So as much as possible, I'd want to bring a charger that can charge as many of the batteries that I have. And to be honest, I only bring around four to six different batteries. So I'm not really asking for much. Well, this brand recently sent me this modular camera battery charger that actually solves that problem. So today we're taking a look at this, whatever is inside this box. And of course I'm talking about this unique camera charger or camera battery charger that will really make things more simple for you no matter how many batteries you use and how many batteries you bring around when you travel or when you shoot on location. So this is the X-Star SN4 camera battery charger. And definitely what got me interested when they sent me a message about this charger is how it will simplify my charging process whenever I go out. Now, of course, this sample was sent to me by Xstar, but they did not pay me for anything that I will say on this video, and they did not dictate anything that I will say as well. Now, let's go ahead and see what's inside this. Basically, they sent me everything that you can use with the charger. So don't expect that when you purchase the single modular charger, you're going to get all the attachments. But this is actually to show you what you can do with the charger and how many you can charge at a single time. Honestly, for a camera battery charger, with this case, it really seems like there's so much inside and it's much bigger than a single charger. But then again, if you have all your chargers in one case like this, it would not be so much to ask. So, okay. So inside is the main charger plus all the different attachments. That is why this particular case is kind of jam packed. So we have one, two, three, four, five, a cable, six, seven, eight modular attachments plus the main one and you can see it right here. So when you get your own basically you can just select which ones are applicable for the batteries that you use and of course they will fit right onto this case. Now let's take a look at the main hub. Of course this main hub is the one thing that charges everything and it basically has four indicators showing you the level of charging or the level of the capacity that you have and when you slide this switch you can remove the so these two ends on the left and on the right are actually contacts for the modular attachments and on top we can see this single USB-C charging port honestly they got me at USB-C. I mean, some of the chargers that I used recently were micro USB and it's just annoying that we're stuck at that phase of technology. So USB-C is such a plus. Now, of course, I'm a Sony shooter. I shoot exclusively with Sony cameras. So I told them that I use the NPF Z100 batteries. And so this is the modular attachment for that. And they actually sent me two attachments for the NPF Z100 batteries. So this single row of chargers can actually accommodate for the four NPF Z100 batteries that I own. And unfortunately, that's as many batteries as I own. Now, before we go on and try to charge anything, let's take a look at what else is inside this package. And right here we have the attachment for the bigger NPF batteries. So this can actually accommodate for the NPF 550, 570, 750, 770, and F790. And lastly, inside this case 
is the 45 watt power brick. So this power brick is going to power or going to charge all the four batteries that you have on board. Of course, the other attachments that they sent were the LPE6 and LPE6N for the Canon cameras, um, EN, EL15. We also have an L LPE8 for other smaller cam uh, Canon cameras. And they also sent an LPE17 for the smaller Canon mirrorless cameras. Plus the NPFW50 for the Sony APS-C cameras, which I also have batteries for right here, but I rarely use them. I think for me, it's going to be mainly the four slots of the NPF Z100 and sometimes the NPF W50. Now, merely basing off of everything I just said and read out, this camera battery charger really has quite a few perks that are unique and compelling for me. Of course, the main thing is the fact that it can charge four different batteries at one time. That's basically one of the biggest things for me because I hate having to plug in so many individual chargers instead of just having one hub to charge all of my battery chargers. And the fact that this one can do four is really a big win for me. Of course, the other benefit of that is that it can also charge other batteries for me. Like for example, if I use the FW50 from time to time, then I don't really have to search for the charger anymore. I can just attach this attachment for the FW50 and I can also do that. If I'm gonna test out other cameras or I need some batteries compatible with other cameras for other things. For example, I might be able to use my LPE6 charger for my camera monitor and I can also use this attachment as well. And really the main thing about this product is the fact that the charger can be used for almost any kind of camera battery. They did say that they will also have the modular charging ports for Fujifilm and Panasonic cameras soon, so do watch out for that if you're interested. And of course, the fact that it uses USB-C is a big plus, and it uses a detached charging brick. What I would have asked for is maybe for a longer cable because I might want to use a longer cable. But then again, you can just get any other USB-C cable that can carry that much power and you're good to go. So I did test out this charger actually before shooting this video and charged all of my batteries beforehand. And I'm surprised that within one to two hours, it was able to charge the four NPF Z100 batteries. And that's all thanks to the 45 watt power brick. Those are basically the benefits of using this charger. Of course, it does its job and that's all you really ask for it to do. And it basically simplifies the charging process for you, especially when you're charging on the go or on location. Being able to charge four batteries at a time in a very short time actually can help you simplify and just be sure that you're never left without any camera batteries. Now I've posted below some links that you can find on B&H and Amazon so you can check this out. And if I do find any local for the Philippines, I will also put the link down below. Now I believe the combinations differ depending on where you're buying it and also where you are located. But I did find on b &H, that this sells for about $50 and I'm talking about the main charger plus the one with the large NPF batteries. Now, if you want to get additional, of course, for example, you want the NPF Z100 battery chargers, then you can get this particular attachment, a single attachment with two ports for an additional $10, a few cents less than $10. And if you want to get another, then that's going to cost you $20 for the two attachments. That goes the same for any of these attachments, depending on what you need. Now, for me in particular, the downside is that they don't have the chargers for the smaller Sony batteries. But then again, that's just me. I want to be able to charge my ZV-1 and 
also my RX100. So the BPX1 batteries do not have any slots on these, but maybe in the future they can have that. But generally, it's a really nice product and I think I'm going to be able to use this quite a lot when I start traveling again. So if you have any questions, any comments, suggestions, don't forget to leave them down below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Thanks for watching.